Learning Objective 4. Identify, explain, and prepare the financial statements. There are four key financial statements. The first is the income statement, which reports revenues and expenses during a period of time. Here's an example of a very basic income statement with a title or heading showing the name of our entity, Big Dog Car Works Corp, and the period of time to which the statement applies, in this case for the month ended January 31st, 2023. The net income is transferred to the next statement, which is the Statement of Changes in Equity. The Statement of Changes in Equity reports the change in the equity accounts during the accounting period. Notice the title of the statement is also for a period of time, just like the income statement. The most basic Statement of Changes in Equity will include at least two columns, one for the share capital and one for retained earnings, and show the opening balances and changes during the year to explain the ending balances, which are transferred to the third key statement, the balance sheet. Here's a sample balance sheet for Big Dog. Notice that the balance sheet is at January 31st, 2023, not for the month ended like the income statement or statement of changes in equity. As its name suggests, the balance sheet has to balance and the items we're looking to balance are assets against liabilities and equity. In fact, the balance sheet is the basis for what we call the accounting equation, where assets equals liability plus equity. So for Big Dog, see here that $19,100 in total assets equals $7,100 in liabilities plus $12,000 in total equity. The balance sheet is also the main source for the fourth major financial statement, which is the statement of cash flows. The statement of cash flows reports changes to the cash balance during the period. And notice how its title shows the same time period as the income statement and the statement of changes in equity. The cash flow statement reports the sources and uses of cash from three major business activities, operating activities, investing activities, and financing activities. To operate or generate revenues and ultimately produce profits, a business must purchase or invest in assets, things like equipment, factories, or even something as simple as a computer. Now to purchase those assets, the firm needs money, or financing, which can come from sources of debt like loans, or equity, which is from the sale of shares to owners. The operating activities then generate profits, which can either be reinvested back into the business to buy more assets, or used to pay down debt or return capital to shareholders. Thus, the major sources of financing for the business include internally generated funds from profits retained by the business, acquiring or taking on debt from creditors that includes banks, suppliers, or bondholders, and issuing of capital like preferred and common shares to investors. Here's a summary of how the financial statements are all linked together. For Big Dog, we can see that the $2,200 income from the income statement appears on the statement of changes in equity as part of what we call retained earnings. The ending balance of the share capital and retained earnings, $10,000 and $2,000 respectively, are shown on the balance sheet as part of equity. The cash balance of $3,700 on the balance sheet is shown in the cash flow statement as the cash balance at the end of the period. In addition to the four core financial statements, there are also essential notes that accompany the financial statements to provide greater detail about the various amounts that are shown in the financial statements.